The loudest picnic I ever attended was on a Wednesday in October 2017. My wife and I walked up the steep hill south of Aberystwyth's Tanaboch beach and sat and watched the sea. The bulky wind roared off the water up our noses and down our throats. Its noise was so copious and persistent that it easily covered up the ringing sound I'd been hearing constantly for the last few years. I wanted to store this wind noise somehow so that during future ear troubles, if I could emit it from my open mouth, it might soothe me with its audible texture. I chewed squishy scotch eggs and wedges of pork pie. When Helena spoke, I watched her lips move so I could be reasonably sure of what she said. Mostly she said things about food and triumph. Since getting married and moving to Aberystwyth, we'd spent months and months looking at this hill without walking up it. And now we'd walked up it and sat on it and shoved delicious lumps in our gobs with the loud wind smacking our jackets. We found a new soundscape. Back at home, I took a book from the shelf, Grits by Neil Griffiths. It's set in Aberystwyth and it formed my first impressions of this place where I now live. Walking around town, certain buildings and streets seem to resonate with the dark tones of the local fiction. I wonder which of the people sat on the pavements or lying on benches might have served as models for the people in Grits. When I hear a group of students bellowing inanely in a pub, I remember the loathing Griffiths' characters never fail to produce in response to this sound. I remember the many times I've bellowed inanely myself, both in groups and solo. The reason I took Grits from the shelf this time was to see what it might say about the sound of the hill we'd just conquered. Was it as noisy for Griffiths as it had been for us? <laughs>